Alrighty, welcome back everybody to another episode of Aquarius. Before we jump into this episode, I want to say a quick shout out and thank you to Christian, Lynn, Raymond Pringle, Thargor, and Jasmine Welch for re-upping your guys' membership here on the channel. Really do appreciate that and appreciate the continued support as we go. So today is going to be probably the biggest grind of all time. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know how, how fast we're going to get through this, but really we got to get $10,000 in order to get ourselves to the exhibit um, it's almost 2 p.m. now looking at the top of the clock. So that means we're about to open question mark. What's going on here? How you doing? Let's see here. What's going on here? Give me inside. Give me inside the fish tank. Like, let me. See. Oh, yeah. I'm pressing the wrong button. Let me check the guppies. How are the guppies doing? The guppies hate their lives because they don't have enough guppy action. I'm wanting the guppies to to procreate. That's what I wanted them to do. I wanted them to be happy and procreate. They're satisfied. They're not really, like, happy, and they're not really upset. They're just there. Right. Now, I, I did change a setting on the, uh, on the, on this. I sell only fish. I checked that. I, I don't know if I, if I, if I should have. Maybe turn that off. I don't want to sell any of the guppies right now because they need to get it on. Anyways, we have $1,500 if we want to go ahead and, uh, and, and get ourselves a fish tank, which we do. We absolutely do. So, let's go ahead and see what we have here. And a regular aquarium. How much is this? Two hundred dollars. Yeah, that's. Uh, excuse me. What? What did they say? No place for aquarium on the workbench. Okay, I understand. Um, in that case, let's pick this up and put this at the front door. And then let's buy our aquarium. Don't ever tell me that I can't buy an aquarium in my own aquarium shop. How dare you? Okay, there we go. And we'll start going through here. Yes, I'm going to reuse my soil. Actually, I am not. I'm gonna get cute with it. <laughs> I'm gonna get cute with it so what instead of that i'm gonna go ahead and go and get some new soil we got like um what seems to be like dirt <laughs> like regular you know what yeah regular this is like a clay almost it looks like a clay we're, we're gonna buy it regardless we're gonna have all different kinds of soil working with it where's the shovel did i i didn't throw away the shovel down did i am i blind where's my shovel it's like almost 2 p.m. Oh my god, it's almost 2 p.m. Can we grab any of these? No, we can't. We sell lamps. I, I guess that's a rebuy a shovel. I'm kind of tempted to sell these like these these lockers. I really am. It, I'm not. We lost a shovel. Give me a shovel. Owned one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. All right, so here we go. Uh, open up. Let's open up. Let, let, let's just see. Let's just see what happens here. Here we go. Um, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, look into the small... Yo, alright, yeah. They're kind of creepy. Yeah, they're like mannequins that just kind of stroll in. Alright, number to visitors, uh, six. Vis visitor satisfaction, 17. $235 earned. Alright, uh, bad news here. Looks like we have to clean our friggin' thing. Okay. Dude, time runs by so fast in this game. I guess I don't have to technically open every single day. I, I, I don't. And the fact that I did, probably, um... Aquarium must be on the workbench to do this. Son of a gun. All right. Playing hardball here. I, I feel like I need to take care of this first before I start working on another uh, this. Now, I am a little curious to see what they bought from this uh, fish tank. I really, really am. I don't even know, dude. Okay, give me in. Yeah, so the, the value of the fish tank actually went down. Now, I don't know if that's because of the algae is going or if that's because okay, now the, the, the value went even farther down. <laughs> If it has to do with them buying decorations, they could have bought decorations, which is a little weird. I'll be, I'll be, honest, I'll be the first to say it. Like, it is a little weird that they're buying decorations out of my fish tank. Like, go buy decorations not out of my fish tank. Like, if you're going to buy any decoration or have any consideration to buying a decoration from my fish tank, buy the entire fish tank. Don't just, like, play around with me, right? Okay, so let's see. What, what are the actual needs here? Let's see here. No, that, that's not what I want. Uh, this, yeah, this is what I actually want. So let's see here. Fish, fish, fish. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Give me the fish. These, like, this is like the worst fish to start out with. Why? Because they're the tiniest fish of all time. Okay, I need decorations and I need plants now. Decoration plants, and you know what? I'm just going to go all in and give them a bunch of other guppies. They're going to have a good time with each other, I guess. Let's put a freaking root in there. <laughs> $74? Oh, my God. Okay, yeah, you want a root? I got you a root right here. There's your freaking root. Nope, yeah, yep, cool. Okay, where are you? Where, there you are. 
Okay, decoration, good. Now it just needs a little bit of plant action. We'll give them a little bit of plant action. Fresh water to be exact. I like this kind of freaky thing. Let's do that. Yeah. Now let's bring this up. Oh my god, this thing's massive. Um, We're running out of space in this damn uh, small aquarium. Right there. Perfect. Now, that's good. Plants, well, we could actually honestly use one more plant. We could, we could, we could. Let's go fresh water. Let's say, I would like to have like the, a, a tiny little plant. Like, let me see here. What is this? Give me, I guess I can change the size. Yeah, let's change the size. Tiny plant, please. Tiny plant. And then what I'll do is I'll, I'll add more guppies and just say, you know what? Screw it when it comes to the procreation. Uh, uh, what is that sign down there? What are, what are you in need of? What are you in need of? I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. What, what are, what are they, what, what are they complaining about right now? It can't be oxygen. It can't be oxygen. That's not an oxygen thing. Is that too crowded? Maybe that's too crowded. Maybe they're like, you know what? I don't like this. Too crowded. Um, right. Uh, take it out. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Oh my God. Okay. All right. All right. All right. One thing at a time, please. One thing at a freaking time. I was not expecting this to be so damn... How you like that? I sold it. I sold the plant. Oh, is that not the right plant? Maybe that's the wrong plant. Wait, where did it go? Maybe this is a seawater plant. I'm an idiot. Was that a seawater plant? No, that was a freshwater plant. Yeah, that was a freshwater plant. I don't know what happened there. Okay. Try again. Try again. Okay. One. Place. Look, now they're happy. Okay, now they're happy. Three. Skip to my freaking loo. Come on. Come on. Right there. Okay, I think they'll be fine. I Honestly, I really do. They should be A-OK. -okay. There we go. Okay, they're happy. What do we got? Okay, decoration plants, good. Temperature's good. Okay, let's give them a bunch of guppies now. Yeah, let's give them a bunch of guppies. Go in here. Give me this. Bring me, like, seven. Yeah, that's a lot. I know. But I'm ready to go. Okay, drop in. Yeah, I need to probably... Oh, God, I threw the fish out the... <laughs> Wait. I threw the fish out the window, dude. Okay. Grab this. Put it in. Okay, there's a couple more. All right, hang on. There we go. Okay. Now, was that too much or was that just enough? Let's see here. No. Good dude. This is like the most obnoxious fish of all time. Yes. Okay, good. Fish amounts good. They're very, very happy. Now they should probably be having a good time in it. They're going to start partying. All right. Good Lord. Let's move this out of the out of here. Okay. Now let's focus on a big, big guy here. Let's focus on a very big uh, fish tank. Now, what kind of fish would I like to buy for this in particular uh, one? Well, actually, let's not get too ahead of ourselves. Let's let's just stack it up here. That's not what I wanted. I wanted this one. I want this and I want this. We're going to stack it up here. Let's go six. Add it. And then let, let's go, dude. Here we go. Yep. This might be a saltwater tank. Might be. I know we unlocked a couple of fish at the end of the last episode, and I'm going to be looking into those fish. And I have a feeling those are going to be saltwater fish because they look big. Watch, they're going to be probably small, huh? Is that enough? Okay, that's enough. Put it down. Put it down. But I do like this kind of like clay looking kind of like soil here. It does look pretty good. Let's get the bucket. Let's move. Honestly, sell that. <laughs> Just get it out of here. All right, let's go ahead and do this. And then let's think here. It looked like... The fish that I, I had, it looked like a hammerhead type thing. I don't even know. What what kind of fish was it? I'm kind of curious now. What, what, what fish was it, please? It wasn't a saltwater fish. Oh, it was that. Okay, this is what I'm looking at. A Xander. Yeah, that looks like a hammerhead, you idiot. I'm, I was looking at the Xander because this thing looks crazy. Look at that thing. Wow. Xander is a popular European species. That's crazy, dude. I think I'm going to get that. I'm going to bring that in. Why not? Looks good. Looks really good. We'll do a filter. We'll do a temperature. And then we'll have Xanders and something else in it. Maybe we can have multiple fish in there. I mean, it is a big aquarium. Maybe we can have multiple fish. They can have, like... I, I just don't want the Xander to eat any of the, of the other fish. I know it's probably, like, prob pro probability there is zero. But he looks aggressive. The Xander looks aggressive. Okay. One more dump of water. And we'll get it going on. Actually, we need to buy the temperature and all that. I already said that. And get some oxygen rolling before we buy any fish. Because we already made that mistake of not turning on the filter. And then there was no oxygen. And then they, they suffocated. <laughs> God. 
Okay. It's interesting, though. It is interesting, because, like, in real life, you know, in a pond, right? In a pond, there, there, there's not a filter in a pond. How does that work? Maybe someone can, like, school me on that idea. Like, there's not a... There isn't. There's not a pond, or there's not a filter in the pond. So how are they getting their oxygen then? Let's go for the big baddie here. Let's go for the expensive stuff. Yeah. Let's get the real deal stuff in for this big aquarium. God, Lord. Look at that thing. There you go. Put a nice heater there. Put it up to the wall. Bring that in. Wonderful. Wonderful. Turn it on. There you go. Got the bubblies working. Okay, now the Xander. Do I buy the Xander yet? I'm not sure. Yes, I do. I do. I do. I do. So Xander. So they're looking for a, 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 a tub tank for 16 to 18 temperatures. So if you were to have a company, who are you going to be accompanied by? Well, very simple. You could be a company company by the Sticklebach and the the Roach. So these three fish can actually go together. Interesting. Let's do it. Two Roaches, two Sticklebachs, and two Xanders. Right. I I think yeah, why not? Oh, that's a tiny little fish. At least they're not the reason why they're small is let's be honest here. I'm not buying them at big size. I'm I am buying them them at like one of the like smallest size, but my lord. Look at that. Okay, they're going to be very 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 upset with me right now cuz they're like, "Hey, we have no uh, trees. <laughs> we have no plants." Uh temperature? Yeah, questionable, right? I should have probably turned on the temperature heater before I I dropped you in. I'm sorry. Uh, what is it? Uh, 17. Can we do 17? Let's do 17. Heater? On? 7? No, not 30. No, not 30. 17. There we go. There you go. You should be happy about that. Let's give you some decoration. Uh, fresh water. We're gonna add, like, a bunch of these, too. I, I love these. These things are big and delightful. So we're gonna go five of those. We're gonna place them through. And plus, I think they'll look good in the sand. All right, yeah. There you go. Uh, two, please. Kind of just go through here. There you go. Yeah, you guys are going to have a great time. And then, like, over here on this side of the aquarium, this is where the decorations go. How are you guys doing on the on the plants? <laughs> you basically told me not enough. This roach told me that was enough plants. The Xander said, are you kidding? And the uh, Sticklebox said, are you kidding? Okay, so this is going to be a little bit troublesome. Okay, all right. Hmm. Uh, let's get these, like... Monte Carlo's in. Oh my god, dude. Forty-one dollars. We're gonna run out of money. Just based off of all like okay, let's not go for the Monte Carlo. Let's not go for the most expensive sounding thing. Let's just go for the simple this. Grass. Bring it in. Alright, very good. There you go. Okay. Now number two. That was gonna you know what? That was going to be you know what? No, I, I take it back. I take it back. This is terrible. <laughs> Oh my god. Just play stuff randomly. That's it. <laughs> Just do it, dude. Grab this, though. I, I do like the fact of that being like the decoration zone. Possibly where a castle is and, and, and all that. Okay, yeah. We're already having plant issues. Xander, how you doing? Getting kind of being a dick. Alright, your plant issue is good, though. Uh, Your plant issue, Sticklebox, this is a disaster. Roach, how you doing, Roach? Roach is like, I don't mind the plants. Sticklebox needs a little bit more... Of the plants the only problem here is that the um, the uh, the the Xander is like I don't want too much plants it's like you sons of guns dude everybody's picky in here Xander are you happy with the plant okay yeah too much plants all right right yeah thank you for that buddy you know what no Xanders take out the Xanders if they're gonna be a uh, if they're gonna complain about everything they're gone I will make a separate tank for them. Okay. The Sticklebock are good, and the other guys are good, too. The uh, the Roach, right? They can at least... Oh, God. They can live together in peace and harmony. It, it, some fish, you know, they can roll together. Some fish, they can't roll together. And you can obviously see that was that was a moment in time where uh, ro uh, Xanders could not roll together. It is what it is. Okay. Now, let's go here, and let's add a... <laughs> A freaking castle as well. 145. I can't do that any justice. Let's do an 8. 138. Can't do that any justice. Uh, 250. Can't do that any. Oh. All right. Let's go statues. Let's give them a nice uh, bust to look at. Let's give them a nice head. And let's give them a column because why not? 
Okay, so let's go column first. Oh, these are actually pretty big. Okay, column first. Uh, that almost fell. Let's go another column. That almost fell as well. And then in between, we go lady in pink. No, no, no. No, no, no. Rotate. 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 I wish you could kind of rotate this not like this. Yeah, it's 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 story time, right? It's the store is about to open. Okay. Well, I mean, we're not opening today, let's be honest. Have creepy lady look out the window? Yeah, we're all right with there. How are you doing decoration wise? Roach? Okay, hates it. Wants more. Okay, Roach wants more. Where's the sticklebock? 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 Are you a you're a roach? You are actually still a roach. Where's your buddies? Are they dead? <laughs> Where where where's your community at uh roach no 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 sticklebock excuse me are you guys hiding oh my god i should just buy bigger fish there they are damn it that's the roach there they are okay i see him coming in hot that's the roach <laughs> oh my god am i blind that's the roach oh there they are they're so tiny they're so tiny. Where did he go? Oh my lord. There they are. Yo. You went you swim so fast. Okay, Sticklebot. So far, not good on the decorations. Could use more. Fish amount. Definitely hate the, the, the fish amount. I am really investing into these freaking fish. I, I really am. And I, I'm a little disappointed in myself. I I'll be real with you. Like I'm like I feel like I'm their bitch. Yeah. Yeah, I, that's how I feel. I feel like I have no say into this uh business that I'm in. I feel like they run my life. Kind of feels like how I run with the guinea pigs and the, yeah, <laughs> they run my life as well. Okay, so let's just sprinkle a little bit of weird stuff around and hopefully the fish will like it. Yeah, a little bit of this action, a little bit of that action, and a little bit of this action as well. Okay, good. Uh, finding the sticklebox. Okay, the roach, they say add more decorations tool. Sticklebox, same thing, same thing. All right, all right, all right, I feel you. Now, our collecting money has definitely gone the opposite direction, which, you know, it is what it is. Would you guys like a skull or like a uh, rundown treasure chest? How would you guys like this? I know we're running out of money, but my lord, I'm trying to please these guys. I think I could do this. Let's move that. Rotate that. I mean, let's be honest. When we're like in real life and working with fish, do we like really like sit there and like Oh, yeah, I'm going to put this in a specific spot so that they can enjoy this. Well, maybe, but not all the time. Just place it right there. Okay, how you doing? Roach? Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Roach, decoration, please. It's almost there. It, it, it really is almost there. Maybe one or two more decorations. Dude, this fish pisses me off. Sticklebock? Hold the hell still. You're nowhere near either. Okay, all right, you really are going to be pushing me to the edge now, are you? I, I hate that you're going to do this, but it it's happening. It is happening. Let's go with, like, the, the, the red rock. Not two of them. Maybe one of them. Red rock. I like the red rock. Kind of goes with the, um... Goes with the, uh... The, the color of the sand. Yeah. Let's work on this side. Oh, my God, this rock is massive. Okay, all right. Was not expecting that either. That thing is huge. I just threw it. Okay, this is huge too. You know what? I'm going to throw that too. This is massive. Oh my god, dude. Watch, now it's going to be too much for them. They're going to be like, oh yeah, we hate this. <laughs> dude, that's too much for me. This is a confusing mess. Decoration's fine now. Plants are fine. Temperature's fine. Now I just need the fish amount. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Now where's the sticklebox? Uh, sorry, the, the Xander said this is a great place to live. Where's the Sticklebox? There he is. Sticklebox says this is a great place to live also. Great. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and buy more fish. And we're on the right track here. So, Sticklebox, let's go ahead and buy three of you. 69 giggity. Love to see it. And then, um, let's go ahead and hit you with a Xander. Yeah, hit you with a one Xander because they're a $100 fish. Oh, righty. And let's see if that finally completes the aquarium for now. Like, we don't have lights. We don't have lights. And we don't have a backdrop, which I would love to give a backdrop. So where are we sitting at here, Roach? You wish there was more. What? There's a roach? Why is there a roach? I'm an idiot. I wanted a roach. I didn't want a Xander. That's fine. 
Luckily, I only bought one Xander. I want the Roach. And I want two, please. Thank you. Now we're really living life on the edge. Oh, my lord. Good thing I don't have to pay utilities, at least, I don't think. Okay. All right. Where are we living here, Roach? You're kind of on the edge there. You're kind of on the edge with the fish amount, but that's all right. Sticklebock, where are you? Sticklebock, how you doing? Oh, my effing god, dude. You just, you can't do it. The fact that exiting out of the aquarium or exiting out of the tank is right click the same button to actually inspect the fish drives me a little nuts. Sticklebot could use just a little, little bit more company, right? Maybe we should add like a bunch of little tiny Sticklebox in here and that will be life. Yeah, one fish is all we can afford. All right. And then we're going to have to do something spicy here. You think I can open up shop even though it's 1730? Oh, I guess I can. Don't touch my big aquarium. Don't touch that aquarium. I just told you not to touch that aquarium. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, dude. 50% satisfaction, $839. I mean, it's good. It is good, but like... I don't know. I'd rather them not touch my decorations. Now, I might be able to prevent that. I, I, I will. I will say. I probably can prevent that. If I just, oh God, if I just tell them to not touch, right? I, I guess so. Like the, the, the little bit of, like when you're clicking on the, um, what is it? The, uh, the, the, the tank inspection, right? And it tells you enable this and enable that. It's a little uh, like confusing because I don't understand it completely. It says enable tank and then it says enable fish. I'm assuming if I say turn off tank, then that means they will not touch my tank. I'll have to test that theory out, though, 100%. All right, so we did a good job up until we, like, sold a bunch of big rocks. Now these guys are going to be pissed. Wait, what the heck? Temperature? These water plants have to have temperature? The plant is dead because of the temperature? The tutorial didn't tell me anything about temperature for plants. <laughs> it didn't tell me anything about temperature for plants. I mean, I get it. It makes sense. But like, still, I, I didn't know we were going in that freaking depth. Oh, my Lord. Now you have to worry about temperature for plants. You're, you're actually trying to kill me, huh? You're, you're, you're trying to you're trying to knock me out of the ballpark here. Well, you're doing a good job at it. I, I will say let's like make this a little smaller. Who knows? Maybe that's a better idea. These things are massive. Okay. You should be good on decoration. You're only bad on not having enough company. That's that goes for the Sticklebock as well. So Sticklebock. Six. Six. Give me six. Drop it in. And then this son of a gun. Okay, you guys should have enough plenty of attention. Roach. Fish amount is low. Now it might be because of his own species. He might be looking for his own species, and he's like, wow, we're in a we're in a tank full of Sticklebox. And the Sticklebox, like, yeah, we love the Sticklebox. Sticklebox are, are, are G. Now, the Sticklebox are kind of complaining about a little bit of decoration here, so let, let, let's work with it here. Um, honestly, take a skull and call me in the morning. <laughs> Damn it, we already had a skull. Should have probably gave him another, like, column. I thought the guys would have bought the other skull. That's fine. Okay, okay. That roach is getting big, yeah? Um, unless that's the size it comes is. I don't know. Uh, okay, okay. That tiny little bastard. Okay, decoration could... Okay, we could use one more. One more decoration and we're good. Let's give them the column back. There we go. Now, the only thing that we have to really do is just buy more roaches. And we can sell this thing for like $1,300. Is it worth it at this point? I honestly have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. We'll buy two roaches. Very good. Very good. Okay. And we'll add it. Boom and boom. That should be good. Now, the next thing that we could add to this is a backdrop. Yeah. I'm going to go with this one because I like it. We're going to go with that one. And then I'm going to go with a light. And I'm going to go with two. Buy two lights to add to this. Go ahead and add a backdrop. Put that right here. Wonderful. And then let's actually put these lights on the back as well. So let's go. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Then we'll do this. 
and we'll do that. Okay. So since this is like a like a sandy pit with a little bit of glowy in the back, let's go ahead and make this. I was thinking yellow. That is awful. Green that is awful too. Red that's terrible. Pink. Ugh. Let's just do white. Yeah, white actually is fine here. Let's just do white. We'll do white. White will be fine. Blow it up and turn it on. Cool. That's a good looking fish tank, I think. $1,700 fish tank. What will they do? Now, Q, enable for shop. Off. So, that means this fish tank can kind of marinate <laughs> a little bit. And what I mean by that is, like, they can sit here and procreate, maybe. Uh, we could sell fish and enable that, but I don't want anyone buying any freaking decoration from anything. Now, you guys over here kind of got bombarded, and I'm so, so sorry. Yeah, okay, yeah, two dead fish, absolutely. Uh, two guppies, dead. What from? I couldn't tell you. Does it tell me how, like time of death and why they died? No, but can you guys tell me what happened in here? Decoration plants. You need some decorations and some plants? Yeah, you know, I had that issue off on the other side of the, of the, of the room here. We kind of went from that. I'm going to give you a freaking wood. Wood root. A wood root, and I'm going to give you a, um, a, a, a plant. A Ludwig. That I don't even know if they stay alive in the temperature that we're in. Apparently, you have to have, like, temperature for plants, and I had no idea. I wonder if anybody else knew that. I really do, playing the game, right? Did anybody else knew that they had... I have two roots in here. I'm an idiot. Uh, did anybody else have to, like, know that their plants died, too? Like, I don't know, man. What's the effect on it? How you doing now, guppy? Yeah, you're fine. Decoration fine, plant fine, temperature fine. Uh, now the only thing you you politely ask of me is like getting your dead brothers and sisters. I got you. <laughs> all right, hang on a sec. Yep. Yeah, it's a sad, sad day in the guppy world, but that's all right. There we go. Very tiny creatures. Isn't that incredible? Could you imagine being that small? It's kind of crazy. Okay. So what we're gonna do now is we're actually gonna tell them, no shop open for you. Do not take anything from this aquarium. Do I not have a light on this? They took my light, didn't they? They did take my light on this. You sons of guns. Okay. They will not... Uh, I can't tell if that's on the back. That is... What was? What color was this? I don't even know what color this was. No, not pink, please. Green? The green's not bad. I like the yellow. I think it was yellow before. Maybe not so damn bright. Maybe like dim it down a bit. That's better. Okay. I don't want anyone taking anything from this. I don't want anybody taking anything from this. If I invite customers into my store, it will be solely off of the fact that they are here to buy retail stuff. Not so that they can just rummage through my damn fish tanks anymore. It, it ain't happening. It ain't happening. In the meantime, we can at least take a job. So clean this aquarium glass with a sponge to complete the job. I click on the order. This is super easy. How much money can you actually get from this? We're going to find that out. Is that all I have to do is clean it up or do I have to do like a whole freaking job? Because if I have to do a whole thing, a whole, you know, giddy up and have to dance with this thing, I, I, I have $35. I can barely afford a fish fillet back to the last episode. <laughs> okay. All right. I don't think I can buy myself a surf and turf. That's for damn sure with $35. Not happening. At least not a, a, a legit surf and turf. Okay. I wonder how much money I can give for this. Okay, cool. Yeah, we're done, yeah? Okay, and then end job. 100 bucks. Easy 100. Let's take another one. Same job, right. $100 maybe. <laughs> Will there be other jobs? Your guess is as good as mine. Hopefully. But, you know, for right now, this is fine. We can do this. No big deal. Give us a couple hundred. Able to refill our, our, our stock here, our shops. And then in the meantime, we have to hope that these other fish, or not these other fish, but all these fish end up, you know, doing it. Uh, eggs. Uh, babies. Uh, I'm looking strictly at the um, at the roaches over there. I would say Xanders, but the Xanders, my God, they were needy. So freaking needy. Yeah, all right. Three times in a row for cleaning, um, cleaning aquariums. Maybe this is the only job that you're allowed to do that, that you can do at least. Maybe, unless it changes down the road. But at least for right now, can't do really much of anything. 
Now, if we were to want to sell this, we could almost sell this aquarium for $2,000. And we could almost sell this, for, well, we can sell this for $1,100. So that's about $3,100 altogether. That does not give us um, 10 grand. <laughs> and maybe what we need to do is we need to get these fish going or these aquariums like built up. And then what we need to do is in the meantime, kind of clean, grind, get that money, right? Get that money, baby. And then sell, obviously sell through our retail shelves and things like that. I don't know what the profit margin is really when it comes to our shelves. I can't imagine it's a lot considering we have to pay like X amount of money to refill these things. But you know, I, I guess maybe over time, let's see here. What is this? What is that? Oh, sell for that for three bucks. Yeah, sell that, sell that, take another job, clean another glass and have a Coke and a smile. All right. Have a Coke and a smile. That's what the game wants me to do. That's what I'm going to end up doing. A Coke and a smile. Here we go. So, 2 o'clock coming through. Oh, shoot. I thought I messed up. 2 o'clock coming through. I have the things toggled off. Right? I have the things toggled off. So, that should run the test. Right? The test of will the customers buy from the fish tanks? They shouldn't have to buy from the fish tanks now. They shouldn't at all buy from the fish tanks because I don't want them to buy from the fish tanks. Uh, I'm, I just want to, I want to build up the fish tanks, really. Thank you. Let's see here. How are we doing? Enable for shop. No, sell only the fish. No. How is the fish actually coming along? Are we doing okay here, gentlemen? <laughs> We're procreating with all gentlemen fish. <laughs> you know, isn't like a, isn't like a seahorse? Fun fact, I, I think, right? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm right about this. Um, seahorses, the male are the ones that care, that are the ones that get pregnant. I'm pretty sure the males are the ones that get pregnant, not the females when it comes to seahorses. Imagine a world that we would live in if that was the case <laughs> in real life. Holy crap, right? I know. All right, let's, I guess, keep cleaning. I'm going to wait. This will be the last tank I clean until we open up the shop to see what happens. I guess one thing to do kind of early on, though. It's, it is very, very important to sell these uh, tanks and all that uh, to earn the XP, I guess. I, I am kind of overlooking the XP part of the game. Because the more you level up, the better things you get, the better fish you get, the better this and that and that and this you get. So that is a crucial part of the gameplay. Now, I really wish, and I think I mentioned it in the last episode, I really wish that they would give you an idea, like, what your level or your XP is. Because I have no idea. I don't know where our level XP Like, do I have to press a button to see? I don't think so. I think it just happens. There you go. So what I do is I'll, after, after this shop, I will sell this entire tank for $2,100. I will sell this tank for $1,000, right? I know what I said about growing. Look, this is, this is a let's play live commentary. Things happen on the fly. Things change drastically. Now, you know what? Get rid of this. This is money that's just sitting around. Oh, you can actually put shelves there too. Wonderful. And you could put a cabinet which is good for our tools yeah i think that's our tools or is that a retail cabinet i'm not sure i think that's a retail cabinet now looking at it that's extra money in our pocket we almost have thousand a thousand dollars let's open up our shop wonderful here we go yeah look at it you can look all you want you can't take anything from it though there you go yeah, that's exactly what we wanted that's exactly what happened there very very good yeah satisfaction 50 percent 102 dollars earned that's honestly sucks but okay how are we doing twenty two hundred dollars was that twenty one hundred dollars before eleven hundred dollars that went up in value that went up in value yeah i'm pretty sure this went up in value by like two bucks um oh we got to take it to the workbench put it to the workbench now i wonder if i what the hell was that sound i don't know what that sound was if i clean this <clears throat> It will increase the value, yeah? Yeah, it should. Okay, clean this. $590? What are you talking about? You were just at $1,100. Uh, hello? Okay, $925? Okay, cool. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I guess cleaning this, it puts the value up. There we go. All right. Now this should be good to go. Yeah, yeah? $1,104. All right, was that $1,105 before, but I'm not going to sit here and argue about it. It's $1. Okay, so... That noise again um what we're gonna do is we're gonna sell this bad boy first i'm gonna sell this one first because it is something that is is smaller easier and, and somebody can be happy with the guppies are you sure you want to sell this i do 
Okay, it did not level us up, <clears throat> which was that was the whole point of it. I was hoping that it would level us up. It did not. Okay, let's go into here now. Sorry. Uh, and let's l sell this thing for 2333. No level up. Maybe what we level up is maybe when we complete quests. So now we have $4,500. Well, $4,400. We can go ahead and start looking into another. I'm going to go. Whoa. I'm going to start going in with another big one. So let's see here. $200 for a big tank, right? $200 for a big tank. Soil that we've bought already. That was a while ago. I'm going to use the same soil. And the reason why I'm going to use the same soil is because it's like a cost effective thing. Like we don't have to keep purchasing. Uh, whoops. We don't have to keep purchasing soil. Um, because that would really dip into our profits. So I'm going to use the same soil. Don't use different soil all the time, you idiot. Use something, buy one bag, use it up, and then, you know, when you're ready to get more soil, get more soil. But, uh, yeah, let's, let's, let's be smart about this and try to maximize our profits the best that we can. Okay, grab a bucket. Now, when it comes to fish, I don't know what fish I'm going to put in here. And when it comes to plants, <clears throat> I don't know what the hell plants to put in here either because I don't want plants to die. I do not want plants to die, but I don't want to have fish and then like the fish, like the fish trying to figure out decoration and plants for the fish. I get it. I understand. And then trying to balance plants that die like that is a whole thing. I'm like temperature wise. I am not familiar with. I guess you really have to learn unless the game tells us in the description like, oh, yeah, this <clears throat> this fish or sorry, this plant takes this temperature. If it does, I'll look into it. I'll look into it. Because then that will be better overall, right? But I don't know. I don't think I saw that. Okay, let's fill it up. $129. So we could lose $70 if we sold that tank the way it is right there. Because that aquarium was 200 bucks overall. Okay, right. So then I think overall we should probably be... Um, we should probably be doing the cheap stuff. Let's do the cheap heater. Let's do the cheap thermometer. Let's do the cheap filter. Sorry, the cheap one. And the lights, they give it effects and plus the lights actually do raise the price. So, and then we'll do like two of these. No, 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 not that. This, two of those. Okay. Put out the heater or whatever the hell that is. Put out whatever the hell that is. I mean, heater temperature, I can't really tell the difference. And then put that out. And then these will go onto the back. And we'll kind of get into a rhythm here. Light there. Light there. Figure out a backdrop, right? Okay, let's let's do that. Let's do the backdrop first. Because this is kind of like something we do last. But let's do the backdrop. There's actually the one I want to do is the jellyfish. I think the jellyfish is pretty cool. Therefore, I will do it. Now, we could be doing simple ones like this. Simple backdrops that are a lot cheaper. Maybe that's the way to go. Maybe this is just too too bad, big and bad and bougie. Maybe this is too bougie for people. I don't know. But look at that. That looks really good. Yeah, I like that. All right, so now fish. This is the hardest part of it all. <sighs> salt water or fresh water? Since we have to buy salt for salt water, I'm sticking with the fresh still. Who knows? Having a big-ass fish could be good for us. Um, Plant-wise, let me see here. Fresh water plants. Does it say a temperature? It does, you actual idiot. You actual idiot. Wonderful. Okay. Mix and match. Let's max and mix. Mi mi ma match and mix. I don't know. Let's go fresh water. What's something we haven't really done? Well, this pearl, we have not done. This Oscar, we have not done. No, wait. We might have done the Oscar. This discus or discus fish. I don't think we've done that. You know what? We can go back to the Xander. It is a big fish, right? It's a it's a big investment type fish. One hundred and eighty dollars, eighty nine dollars for this big son of a gun. We can invest five. We can invest thousand dollars into this fish. You know what? Let's go all in. Let's see what happens if we get five massive fish that need a temperature of sixteen to eighteen. This might be a terrible idea. Um, that need a temperature of sixteen to eighteen. So what we'll do is we'll go heater. We'll do seventeen. We need plants. Turn on the oxygen too, you idiot. Don't kill the fish. Uh, we need plants that are going to be in there. 17 to 18 range. That is definitely not it. That is definitely not it. That is definitely not it. Close, but not it. Close, but not it. 
18. Okay, so that has 18. That might be our only plant. 18. Oh my god, that's our only plant. Wow, we got close. So, we're going to need to buy a lot of these. Probably like 7. What we're going to need to do is we're going to need to readjust this. Not that. This. This is not 17 anymore. We are now bumping up to 18. That is the max that we can do. And I think that's the max that we could do for the actual fish. Let me just double check here. 18. Okay, good. That works out. Okay. Um, Drop them in. Yo, look at those beef cakes. Okay, now... Oh my god, I made a mess. Okay. Put it in. Really? It doesn't matter. I'm just throwing them in. I am. I am. I could put them in my pocket, right? You know what? Let's do that. Uh, Can I just, like, put it in my pocket? Those are so tiny. Like, those, those little tiny little things. Grab? Yeah, I'd like to put it in my pocket. All right. Those are so cute. <laughs> They're so tiny, dude. You got big fish with small plants. Okay. Let's see here. Now, we know they're going to be needy. We know that they're going to need a little bit of, like, decoration. We know about that. Fish amount's perfect. They say, you know what? You did a great job on the fish amount. Now, give me some plants. They want a little bit more on the plant side. So, we're going to add a little bit more. Let's go a little bit bigger. Let's go a little bit bigger. Let's go uh, $32 on three of them. That's fine. Now, what we'll do is we'll come in here. And we'll put a little... Oh, my Lord. <laughs> oh, jeez. Now, we're definitely going all in. These things are huge. Okay, how are you doing on the decoration terms of things? You want some decorations. Got it. These fish are going to be extremely happy. Yeah. These fish are going to be happy. We're going to give them a nice anchor. Two anchors. We're really investing into these. Because I want to see how much I can actually sell this for. Bam. Anchor over there. Okay, watch out. Don't get hit. Anchor over here. Watch out. Don't get hit. You got hit. All right. Where are you standing now? You want more decorations. I respect the grind, okay? I respect the grind here. Let's go big castle. Massive castle for massive fish. I mean, it's not that big of a fish, but my lord, look at that. Let's put you right there. Jellyfish Island. You guys should be super, super, super happy with that. You guys are not happy with that. Fair enough. Again, you guys are... You're, you're, you know what you like. You know what you want. You know what you want in life. I'm going to go ahead and go with some weird r roots three of them two of them because i just realized how expensive they were let's go on each side here each side wonderful how you doing xander decoration is almost there maybe a couple more and we're good to go okay a couple more and we're good to go not that let's go treasure yeah let's go treasure and let's buy you a treasure and put it under your castle this is this is where your treasure is it's right under here it's right there. Don't worry about it. It's right there. It's, it's safe. Okay, now you. You're happy. You guys are all happy fish. Look at him. <laughs> He's so happy, dude. He's super, super happy. Yo. He's a happy little fish. He's a happy little guy. I, I say they, but they all. Look at him go. You go, partner. I'm losing my voice because I'm very, very happy with you. Okay, you are inside of that? That was pretty impressive. Okay, I, I'm sorry. I got lost in the sauce there. <laughs> okay, that is not available. We are not selling this. This is a $3,000 tank, potentially. <clears throat> now, if we were to sell this for about $2,800, that would put us at what? It would put us at around $46-ish, maybe $4,700. Why does that feel like a loss to me? Or it doesn't. Maybe I made $400 from this actual tank if I were to sell it right now. Interesting. Interesting indeed. So maybe one of the best ways to do and go about this is simple. Keep what you have. By the way, we haven't turned on the lights. Keep what you have, right? Kind of like the blue idea. Keep what you have. And what we do instead... Is we avail make this available to sell the fish only. You can only buy the fish. Because the fish are expensive after all. Right? The fish are expensive after all. And then what we'll do is we'll refill our retail here. I feel like we've made no progress. No money progress at least. And then that will be that. Okay. Take a job. Alright. So we're going to take this job just to do it real quick before the day starts. And 
I'm trying to figure out like the, the best way of the, the best way to play this. Do we keep and do we build a bunch of aquariums and then just sell fish as we go? You know, kind of breed fish, sell fish, clean fish, do fish, and then just keep adding on top of our uh, aquariums. I, you know, I don't know. Because even if I did sell this, this this aquarium, it's not it's it's not profitable. Well, it's 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 very slightly marginal, <laughs> very slightly marginal. Like we're making two to three hundred dollars after constructing this beast, right? It's interesting. It's definitely an interesting take on it for sure, for sure. Um, maybe I went too premature on th this table, that table, and these shelves. Who knows? Uh, I don't know. All I know is that it's gonna be a grind and a half. But it's a good grind. I don't think it's a bad grind. I think it's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's all right. And this will get better over time. I guess maybe if I set this to no sale on the fish, um, you know, I don't know. I, I'm going to keep it on the sale just because if they do buy these fish, these fish are not cheap. I just wish I knew how much these things went for. All right, open up. You're going to buy my fish? No, not interested. They're interested in that, but they're not interested into the into the into the Xanders. That's all right. That's okay. Yeah, hundred sixty one dollars after overall. You know, that's all right. Probably gonna go back into doing this, right? Maybe, or maybe I just let it be. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting take. Two thousand dollars. If we wanted to, we could sell that for twenty eight hundred dollars, but we're not going to. Instead, we're gonna probably invest into another aquarium, and that's where we're gonna go. We're gonna kind of just go about and breed as we go and keep our fish hold on to our fish make single single tanks for certain fish and we'll go from there i think these fish overall are happy let me just double take yeah they're happy they might be saying too much on the you know too many fish in here they might be procreating with without me knowing right uh overall though good i can sell it for three grand now yeah there must there must have been a spawn yep i do i see the little tiny little guy right there yep there was a spawn very good very good. Good job, guys. Good job. Anyways, that's going to do it in today's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, make sure to hit the like if you want to see more Aquarius. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Do take care.